can the IRS track your cryptocurrencies? Welcome to White Coffee Break where we are giving you tips and tricks to any tax payroll, bookkeeping plus PPP and now even cryptocurrencies. Yes, they can. There are two forms you have to remember that you might receive if you are doing cryptocurrency investment. Number one is uh, the 1099K. Letter K for Kenya, 1099K, and the second form is 1099B. What are the difference of these forms? The 1099K, it is the transactions in a month-to-month -month basis. For example, last uh, year 2020, if you started January up to December, you will receive the 1099K from the third-party merchant as long as you have more than 200 transactions of cryptocurrencies or Bitcoin, Litecoin, whatever uh, virtual uh, currency that is and then number two uh, if you receive more than 20,000 proceeds so which means to say if you are a store and then you're accepting uh, you're accepting cryptos like uh, Bitcoin as form of payment if you're selling something and you receive cryptos instead of credit card or instead of cash then it should be more than $20,000 of proceeds for 2020 that's why the trick is remember 200 20,000 for 2020. It means 200 transactions, more than $20,000 in 2020. So you will receive the 1099K. It's like the counterpart of PayPal, any third party payment. That's why uh, that is one form that you're going to receive. It's just going to tell the total amount that you, uh, the cryptocurrencies that you accepted last year. And then the second form in the IRS is what you call the 1099B. That 1099B, this is more like the stocks are exchange on barter, more on trading. But the difference of these two, uh, this has the actual listing. So if you purchase uh, your cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin, Litecoin, Ethereum, they have the listing of what did you purchase last year that is uh, on the form 1099B. Let's say you have number one, Litecoin, number two. Uh, Bitcoin number three ethereum and then how much did you purchase on the second column? It's gonna tell how much is the price the form 1099 beat will tell to the IRS whether you gain or loss or any any capital gains or losses It will tell to that form. That's why you have to remember that before filing your tax return on 2020 You need to have that because if you did not report any of these forms, that's a big red flag to the IRS because those forms are being directly reported to the IRS. So just wait how many years? Three years and you will receive a letter of underreported income on your cryptocurrencies. That's why you have to be careful. It's the best time you consult and then book us here. Click the link below if you have more questions to book the 30 minute consultation. If you have more uh, questions on cryptocurrencies, I covered that on the different parts of our series that's why again i'm christopher irs acceptance agent tax professional and immigrant founder of wyco tax an all year round all-in-one tax payroll bookkeeping service solution if you like this content please click like share and subscribe and then click the link for book your free consultation today because here in wyco tax you deserve the max stay safe